Grant, he's paying 35 an hour. Well, that's not so bad. I mean, 35... It's, uh... 85 hours. Well, it's always continental. Oh, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Look, don't take this out on me. Why not? You're the idiot who goes into this. Well, maybe, if you weren't so uptight. Uptight? Frigid. We'd bet Erm and Stoke having sex like a normal couple. Normal? Is that what we are, Dudley? Yes. The clock is ticking. Well, that's quite a bounty. Are you planning a car boot sale? I'm working for your son. I hope he pays well. Guy stuck a crossbow in my face. I didn't have a choice. Have you ever set fire to an eyeball? Sometimes they melt, sometimes they explode. <laughs> He asked me to break in, strip the room, bring him everything. That's all I know. What's your name? Carter. Well, Carter. I appreciate your honesty. So I can go then? Not yet. You work for me now. Everything he does, I want to know. Take it. I'll hold on to that. Don't be a stranger. Ah, there we go. Right. This is much better, isn't it, eh? Right, well, this is your, your boss's office, and, uh, well, you're late for work, you naughty girl, so... Come on, then. Get to your desk. Actually, could you, could you take the cap off for me? There. Uh, lovely job, thank you. That's the one. OK, now, undo a button for me. Good, and another one. Now, I'll do it all the way down. Go on. Come on, love. There, eh? That wasn't so difficult now, was it? Hmm? Right. Now, you're a busy girl, so, uh, I don't know, do some filing. Right then, bend over the desk and answer that phone. It's ringing. Come on. Yeah? That's it. Good girl. Right. Now, now get those ankles further apart for me. Yeah? Good. You are a very lucky man, sir. Now, slip those panties down and let's see your fanny. Oh. How's that feel? Oh. Oh, good. Turning you on. Stop it, you're hurting me, please. <laughs> oh, I'm bleeding. <laughs> what about my clients? You still owe that money. I'll set the wolf on you. Take me to him. Take me to him now.
Where have you been? St. Anne's, on the dunes, watching the sea. And how was last night? Pleasant? Oh, you're a good little poppet. Run along now. I've changed. I'm trying to make it work with the wife. I won't do penetration. A blowjob, a kiss on your tits, maybe. I had to walk back. No money. You'd gone. I was in the shit. Oh, he's so brave. What about the Greek? I outran him. Come on, come inside. Ruby, I'll be in my bedroom. What's this? It's on the wall. It was a photo. A photo of a girl. It's not here. That's all there was. Howard, I'm thinking of you. I'll deal with him. Well, go on then. Uh, we need a plan. <sighs> Lola. Lola. Oh wait, mind your fingers. Tell me, why'd you turn a burnt-out shithole like that into a club? Prime sight, bottom dollar, what do you care? Ever heard of Franny Krantz? No, oh, should I? Yeah, she loved the place, told me all about it. Let's stop pissing about, shall we? Now, who are you? What you want? Someone I cared for. They got hurt. Oh, yeah, and you think I'm involved? No. I don't know. I thought I knew something. I didn't. You know what, son? You seem like a very troubled young man. Yeah, well, I've had a bad couple of days. No, yeah, skin's on the run. Oh, I better go. What about a job? Doing what? Know your way around one of these. You! You think you can push people around? Do what you want when you can't. I'm not sitting here day after day being stared at by creeps. Then pay back the money you owe. What if I went to the police? <laughs> you wouldn't, would you? Just give me the worst you've got. I don't care what it is, I'll do it. I just want to get out of here. Fine. Yeah, you know, I know just the thing. Now go back, have a wash. You start in an hour. So, are you in or out? I'm in. Thank you.